Hi, this is Mick from mk802shop.com. Today I'm going to be running through a demonstration of the Chinese 1 gigabyte version of the MK802. So uh, first thing you'll notice, this is the Chinese version, but the interface is entirely in English. We set these to English before we send them out. Um, on top of English and Chinese, there's about 40 other languages. There's a lot of languages supported in Android 4.0. First thing you'll notice, even though it's 1080p, it is very smooth. Uh, as I'm moving through these desktops, it's it's not jerky at all, it's moving very smoothly. If I jump into the menu as well, it comes up quite smoothly too. So you'll notice that sometimes there are some jitters, uh, but on the whole it is very smooth playback. So uh, first I'll have a, a look at a video. So we've got a Super HD player installed by default. Uh, this supports up to 2160p and supports a wide range of formats. The one I'm going to play today, this is a MOV container. This is a H.264 video with a rather high bitrate as well, and you'll see it runs rather well. So this is very smooth playback. If you watch very carefully, you will notice there's very, very minor jitters, but it plays remarkably well considering how cheap the device is and how small the device is. Okay, so uh, this player also supports subtitled videos and um, it plays 1080p very well and the lower bit rates and lower quality formats it plays flawlessly. So now I'm going to jump in and play some Angry Birds. You'll see uh, this is running at 1080p too. Not all Android games play at 1080p, uh, but Angry Birds does. Angry Birds Space also runs very well. So you'll notice it's very slightly, every now and then you'll see some choppiness. Um, but on the whole it plays very smoothly. I would like to point out though, I've got, um, I've got Angry Birds Seasons installed as well and that didn't perform nearly as well as Angry Birds Space. So on the whole I've uh, discovered that games do play very well but there are a few exceptions to that rule. So uh, finally I'm going to fire up the browser, namely because uh, I find that this is one of the best features of it. I've got this set up in my lounge room and uh, I do enjoy just sitting around and browsing the net. It's very convenient having plugged into your TV in the lounge room where, where when you're lazing around you can just jump on the net or play some games and I found a really convenient thing to have in my lounge room. So I've got, um, I've got a Logitech wireless keyboard and mouse plugged in at the moment. So that only takes up one of the two USB uh, slots. You're able to plug in a a USB storage device in the other one or other USB devices um, and it works very well. The wireless keyboard and mouse work very well for just lounge surfing. So that's an, an, a demonstration of the Chinese version 1 gigabyte MK802 we're selling right now on mk802shop.com. Um, I hope you come along and have a look. Thank you very much.